doily-esque outfit, <laughs> if you will. Uh, I, I'm, not, I'm not seeing necessarily the doily look there. We'll let Joel. Roxy Michaels briefly. Wow. Oh, look at the big turning sidekick to the body. And now, oh. The, oh. oh, reverse suplex. Incredible up? work there come from there, Jesse Santos. There. Roxy just oh, going, going out the, the arm bar. bar. Oh, no. Santos could be in trouble here. She's turning with it. Can she stack up? Seconds. Does look like maybe still. It looks like maybe she's got it free there. So it's being a little more patient. As she goes oh, look at the beautiful oh, oh, oh. touch to the floor. What happened? Wow. Hands control the wrist there. Trying to break free because she does not want to be slammed. Man, look oh, at that. Nice. Beautiful little front roll into a takedown on the single leg. Oh. oh. Yes. Oh. Look at that. Oh. Look at the athleticism and the speed. See Michaels pressing the action of the cage. Oh no! Wow! Powerful slam to the floor. Your opponent as well. Jump, jump, that was jump, certainly jump. the latter. There you Which go. Her taking her back. She's got her hooks in. Swinging around to the back, looking to attack the neck. All right. So it is Roxy Roundhouse Michaels in the black and camo combinations. More low kicks there from Michaels, and you see punches as well. Oh, wow. To Silva backing up to the cage. Not looking good here early. Big knees inside. Wow. wow she threw her up. Look at that. It looks pretty tight. Yeah, uh -oh. very, very tight there. Look briefly oh. like, wow. Pick up, now supporting the entire weight. You can see Shelly Silva leaping to guard. Tense, tense moments here. Roxy going to try to slam out. It breaks the hold. And now is unloading punches. Big shots. What Can she fight. get the finish? Incredible work here. Michaels. She looks to elevate and slam out of the hole. Wow. Powerful slam to the floor. <laughs> Rampage Jackson-esque <laughs> slam. Power bomb. But Maybe. There we go. There's a little sportsmanship. Work in the midsec. Oh, Shelby. Bent over that looks like those shots are starting to hurt. Trying to get a little payback. Jenny looked like she was trying to go for a guillotine. Ends up going for a judo toss. Oh, with the little knee on the neck. That really, really hurts. Trying to compress the air out a little bit. But she's working for it a little bit. A little more south. All right, there's. She's almost into where she's got the little scissor choke around, but she's kind of pulling it more, doing more of a little neck crank there. That is, depending on who you ask, a good position or not a good position to be in. I don't think she likes that position. I don't think so either. Did she tap? Oh, oh. she went out. Toss counts now for to hold your peace. All right, so it is a main event here at Lingerie Fighting Championships 21. Again, the challenge, uh, it's definitely growing over time. You can certainly see it. Well, yes, wow. she's see, filing her nails this. in the middle of the, of the fight. It's certainly something we're not used to, to seeing. This? <laughs> well, John you can do these things. And look at the big Whoa. takedown right away. Allie Parks came rushing forward, and right away, Patton is in mount and looking to strike. Tactical, changing things up so quickly. Kind of puts the knees on the arms there to pin things down. And now big punches here as well. Feather Haddon pounding away from top position. These are big, big punches here. Allie Baby Doll Parks is in trouble, and that's it. That's the fight. Touch gloves if you want. All right, LSC title is on the line. Our main event here at LFC 25 kick. Yeah, nice kicks. Yeah, with a what looks to be a, a, about a 35 pound difference. You know, that really weighs in the favor of Garcia. That if she gets in that clinch, she's gonna have her way. Out of the clinch range. I think she'd probably like to strike from distance. Although, wow, gets inside. What do I know? Running at it. wow! My goodness. That was incredible. Now she's got that left arm isolated again. It's that kind of bizarre position she was in earlier. Can't get the advantage in the clinch. Michaels does circle off, though, not giving up easily. They reset back to the center again. A little more than a minute left. Into the clinch. Garcia with the trip. And Garcia left the return. Oh! Rushing takedown attempt there from Michaels. The aggression from Word on that, but it sure does sound like there's a little bet going on there with her and Kane. And 
It's not interesting. Touch the corner if Kyle's really thinking about everything that is on the line or if this is just more personal for her. Yeah, it definitely. I think initially, definitely the fighter wants to get that win back. Oh. That's a tough way to get oh, it done right there. that'll get things out of your head right there. <laughs> Can't think much about the coach in the rematch when you're getting flipped over. Nearly these two fighters. Prez in the black. Kyle in the... Uh, In. Maxine Frost seems to be able to get the fight here pretty much any time she wants it. It's just what she does from here. Extend those legs to do a kickoff. Oh, nice job. Yeah, straight oh, into straight the arm, arm bar. And the, the tap. Wow. Quick finish. Incredible work there. Unbelievable. Your corners, touch gloves if you wish. Come out fighting. Not afraid to strike. You see the aggression from Ryan Ryan's just running forward. And look at the beautiful toss to the ground by Roxy Michaels. The head and arm throw, just another kick to the body there. Back and forth on the beat, a high kick. Wow. Roxy's not willing to, to, to just <laughs> stick to wrestling. She, she says, I'm a little bit of a kickboxer myself. That was incredible technique. And then, of course, it's the kickboxer here with the takedown. <laughs> Fast strikes again. Ryan Ryan. Oh, oh my God. Wow. <laughs> The aggression of Ryan Ryan's worked against her there. Roxy Michaels through the floor and a big right hands on the ground. What an incredible start that was. And another mad dash forward. But Roxy Michaels powers her to the floor. Let it go. Back on the oh. feet. I think they want to end striking. I think oh. they want to end striking. Oh, no, but how about one more <laughs> slam? <laughs> one more <laughs> slam for good measure in the side control. Okay. So it is Jolene, the Valkyrie Hex, and wow, amazing. Right now, she's on the defensive. I think the Valkyrie just enjoys getting in there. Look at the anger on her face as she moves forward. Now it's actually the Vidoy looking for the takedown. Instead, she gets kind of reversed there from the Valkyrie, a suplex. Oh, wow. And now the Valkyrie on the back. Ladoy works to her feet. She might be going for a ride here again. No, she grabs the hair from behind. Can she flip things over? Has to let go. Does she get the ties. top. Incredible work there. Oh. Set on the feet. Has to be for. Oh, oh, a beautiful <laughs> trip there from Hex. Oh. Just threw her to the floor. Still in her repertoire to show here. It's been a tough go so far. She drops down for the leg. A nice little lateral drop there and leaps wow. on top. <laughs> Never been more of a fan of the ref cam than I am tonight. Let's it go in favor of lifting her high in the air. Oh, Slamming nice. into the turnbuckle. Turn wow. Using this ring that we're using for the first time to its full advantage. Oh, and somehow gives it up able to the battle back. through. Yeah, up to the top. Harding it out. Back in range. Overcommit. Protection. Cardinal dives leg. in again there. She does have that single leg wrapped up, but a good sprawl by Forbes. Yeah. That left arm underneath the neck. Yep. Be a dangerous position if she doesn't address it. She's trying to get back to her feet, as you said. That left arm is in place. Now on the bottom, but the left arm still there. Rolls over to the top. Can she get this guillotine? We rotate again. Cardinal on top, but her neck. Is being threatened right now. She's throwing right hands like she's comfortable. Yeah. But she's got it. Oh, saw that one coming. Forbes was ready that time around. And now it's Forbes with the big slam to the floor. She's immediately to the back. Seated position here now. Let's see what Forbes does with it. Does she try to lock in the hooks? Does she stay with the control there? Wasn't quick enough to move. That allowed Cardinal to get back to her feet. Yeah, she looks, Cardinal looks like she's recovered from it. Oh, oh, and then another slam. Right All right, touch gloves now. Forever hold your peace, and let's go hey, ahead what, and man. do this. Blackwell is only listed at one inch taller. Oh, just diving in for the takedown. Got the takedown. Wasn't sure she was going to be able to do that against a much bigger opponent, but Cameron right on top. And she's very comfortable doing that again. That's something she did in high school, undefeated as a wrestler. So this is a very, very comfortable position for Cameron to be in.
get thrown off to the side now is Cameron. Oh, look at that gorgeous technique. Yeah. Did you realize she can't? I was going to say, it looked like she was trying to land that right hand over the top. She might have gotten lucky that it was blocked, to be honest with you. Those low kicks just chopping away there. Unless Blackwell catches it, that is not good. And she's definitely going to strike the face. She really is. She's getting lucky right now that she's not landing, to be honest with you. Cesar Coscano would be right there to take a point away. And the former offensive lineman Blackwell now using her leverage and using her weight on top. Right arm is under the neck there. She can circle around to the back. See Cameron being very aware of the positioning right now, trying to turn inside. But Blackwell rolls her back. Oh, that right arm around the neck. Can she get the choke, the rear naked choke? She's got both hooks in on the back. Cameron is in a lot of trouble here. And she's got it. She went out cold. Right in front of us.